we are approaching one kilometer. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today I want to test the two kilometer range claimed by Parrot for the Beep Up 2 power. So I am on the hill and over there, far away, is a little mountain exactly two kilometers from my current location. Perfect for a test. So I'm going to fly above that house that you see and after that it's an empty field for two kilometers which is perfect. And as you will see, I'm going to fly right off a little village. So let's go ahead with our test. Here we go. So I'm going to give information as I fly. Now you're probably wondering at this point why I did not take off from the left side of the road. That's simply because there was a no trespassing sign where I wanted to park my vehicle and I didn't want to do that. So that's why I'm on the right side. Plus I thought that uh, those wires would give me a gauge for my height for departure. They're about uh, 15 meters high, so I'm going to go to 20 meters. Now I chose this location because there is exactly two kilometers between my point of departure and that rocky hill that you see in the background. And I want you to have a visual during the whole flight. Now we have the speed gauge on the left and the altitude gauge on the right. Now, as I'm approaching those houses, I realized I was a bit low. I like to give privacy to people and I don't normally fly above houses. So I'm going to go up here, as you can see, to uh, 30 meters. Once I passed the houses, I was so focused on the flight that I forgot to go back down to 20 meters. And I wanted to because of the gauge on the right side where you see altitude from the ground. I am at currently 50 meters. So I wanted to be at around 90 meters during the whole flight, which is about 300 feet. I'm going to fly above a road also, and again, I never fly above roads, but I have no choice here. I needed two kilometers. You see that barn on the right side at the bottom of the screen? This is where I wanted to fly from, but that's only 1.5 kilometers, and I wanted two. Now we're, we are approaching 500 meters. That is the drone distance, as you can see here, at the numbers at the bottom on the left side. We are now at uh, 70 meters from the ground. I have my throttle at full. My, my joystick on the right side is all the, way, uh, all the way forward. And that's the maximum speed I can do in video mode. As you can see here, we're at 27 kilometers per hour. I haven't tested my Beep Up 2 power in uh, sport mode yet, but I know it goes uh, much, uh, much faster. We are approaching uh, 90 meters as the altitude from the ground. And if I had not forgotten to go back down to 20 meters from my point of departure, we would be at 80 meters. This is where I wanted to be. And again, on the smartphone, when you fly, you see the altitude from the point of departure. You do not see the altitude from the ground. You see it after when you, uh, when you put in your uh, telemetry. We are approaching one kilometer. And as you can see here, it's an empty field. This is where I fly normally. Uh, no houses, like nobody, no people. It's a very safe flight. Now I'm going to turn slightly to the left in a few seconds. You're going to see that. So I still have full control of the drone. Right there. Our Wi-Fi signal is at minus 70 dBm. That's still a good signal. Look at the flight duration in the upper right corner. And we are, we still have 96% of battery power. That's amazing. With the Beep Up 2 power, we can fly for half an hour with one battery. Yes. Now the river in the background is the St. Lawrence River. We are now approaching 1.5 kilometers still doing 27 kilometers per hour. Now there is a dip in the valley here, so the altitude from the ground is at 100 meters.
at uh, 1.7 kilometers I'm going to turn left again just to center uh, the hill in the middle of the screen so right there so you saw that right there now if you look at the speed graphic there is a you'll see there is a little uh, uh, dent in it this is where I'm going to lose a signal for a second look at the speed gauge going down to 23 back up to 26 so I lost Wi-Fi for a split second I'm going to lose it again now at this point I'm starting to lose the video feed slightly and when I lose it kind of you know more than I like you will see I'm going to hit the return to home button and by coincidence when I hit the button I was exactly at two kilometers and I'm going back to my point of departure I'm right there I'm going to show with an arrow I'm right at the end here of the um, of the valley up the hill so I'm going to stop the video here um, I don't want to show the return so it's interesting because with all the houses on the right you know most of these houses have uh, Wi-Fi networks so there is a bit of Wi-Fi uh, interference here in the flight and still I was able to get two kilometers this is like simply amazing so thank you guys for watching if you have any questions put them down below in the comment section I'll be happy to get back to you Goodbye.